accuracy. So going back to that last shootout where I where we both hit, you know, a great ball right left. Um, if I would have, you know, hit that same thing with the Spectra, since it's a little bit more accurate, closer to the hole, it might have, have deflected less. Now with these tailwinds, sometimes I still like to use this, but I have trouble stopping it. That's the main reason. So what I'll do with this one, a lot of times, is I'll still use the Bigfoot and I'll just short hit it more. It's basically, I, and this is how I've had to just roll through this tour. I'm not even done this tour yet because I have to hit all these kind of impartial, weird, you know, and it's it's much better to have a balanced bag. But you can see last time I did about that with this tailwind, we're going to really aggressively, you can see I'm moving it almost to the top of that, oh my goodness, the same exact great ball. And you can see I actually hit the fringe, it's rolling out with perfect ball, you know, it might have been a pretty decent shot. But uh, again, that's back to back on that hole. It's something that you really need to take care of. And it looks like I just snuck in and won that one by, you know, a nose hair. And I would have won the last one by a nose hair too. So you can see how close that is, but you know, it just shows how critical that perfect ball actually is in this game. So, you know, the difference between winning and losing here is going to be hitting those ultimate shots. So keep that in mind. Um, you know, hopefully you're able to get them. Good luck out there. I'll see you on the next one.